Gail is a legendary Princeton coach and, and currently adding to that coaching resume as we speak. Uh, however, the Achievement Bowl is the oldest award that U.S. squash bestows. It's given to a woman who's uh, proved to be an exceptional leader and had a broad influence across the game in multiple facets, and Gail certainly fits that bill. I feel lucky to have played, um, had the honor to play for Gail. I'm lucky to consider her a friend. Um, I'm lucky to learn from her as a coach now, and I'm so honored to present this Achievement Bowl to her tonight. So, congratulations, Gail. <laughs> When I first learned about receiving the Achievement Award, I was, of course, thrilled and uh, <clears throat> extremely honored. It was a privilege to wake up each day to work that I love. It made me think about all the mentors, coaches, competitors, friends, coaching colleagues, administrators, and students I have both learned from and shared my knowledge with. I told Gail earlier, when, when Dent asked me to present this award, I was actually shocked that Gail hadn't already won it. <laughs> um, I thought to myself, who else could be more deserving of, of such a prestigious award? Um, I can't think of anyone who's contributed to this, this sport in such a broad sense as a player, as a coach, um, as a mentor for so many, and um, really as a forceful advocate for, for women in the game. One of the highlights of my career is the opportunity to really get to know my students and to be able to expose them to thinking about life skills, and core values. We all understand central to competition, of course, is coaching to win. However, sports provide an environment in which to teach more than just athletic skills, in which to do more than just to win or lose. I've tried to take advantage of the teaching and coaching profession to positively impact my students by upholding values, not only of good sportsmanship and integrity, but to be fully engaged in what they do, committed to the team and teamwork, to be open-minded and accepting and accountable for their actions. I can only hope that my players and students have felt my dedication to them, the respect I have for them, and how grateful I am to have them be a part of my life's journey.